cause some more trouble. You know how we do. Good morning, friends. My name is Brandon Dayton. I am your humble narrator, and I am up with the dawn today. It's only five in the morning, but uh, I have some more scavenging to do. I do think I'll eat a, an MRE for breakfast. It's a meal ready to eat. That's right, kids. And uh, let's see if I could get some more nails. I would really like it. I'm not finding the boxes that I was hoping to find in here, uh, but I guess it'll do. I guess it's just fine. Box of BBs. Hmm. More nails, more nails. Not gonna be able to fit a hundred in this bag, but that's okay. It'll do for now. I'll shove whatever I can. And then, uh, yeah, I'm basically full up because I decided to grab some more pallets with logs and shit like that. So, uh, I'm going to have to head back home in short order. Hmm. I'm just hoping that I could find a few more nails, a few more seeds. That's always a good idea. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Oh, hello, friend. I'm well rested. And you're dead! You're dead because I'm well rested. Nobody saw that coming. And I think I've checked in here before because there's a dead guy. Oh, was that a box of nails? Another empty gas can? Oh, fuck. We're basically full up. I can't drag around this fucking gas can. Damn. That is, uh, quite hurdy. But I did find another box of nails, so I can carry that. Fishing net trap, I will carry that. Nails, wood glue. These are all good things to have. Mm-hmm. Just want to load myself up as much as possible. And we're getting uh, down to the skinny here now. But I need it all. All right. I don't want to encumber myself too much. I think if I just eat a little bit, then I should be able to fit some things. Maybe if I open the canned soup. Have some of this soup. Super good food. Um, where would it be? Oh, in my main inventory. Stop doing this to yourself, Dayton. Don't you see? Hmm. And I think the mall is somewhere around here. It's just quite curious that I can't, um, can't find my way there. I don't like that much. I'm too full to eat. No, I'm not. You drink. You like. I'm just trying to, uh, reduce my weight somewhat. Well, we got a couple pounds free in the, uh, the big bag. Let's shove my fishing trap in there. Good. I'll head home with my, uh, my load of nails. Hopefully I can start working on a little fishing shack or something. Because I do need to find a way to keep myself subsisting even once the generators run out of gas and I empty all the, the food out of the fridges and shit like that. It's not going to be good. It's not going to be pretty. I'll tell you that much. But it should keep us alive for a good long time. I do have a shit ton of food. Three fridges, three freezers, all full of stuff. And uh, I kind of got my farming down a little bit too. So that should be a help, I think, a little bit. Where's farming? There it is. Yeah, farming level two. I'm an ass kicker, man. Tell you what. Should I go check down this way? No, is the easy answer. I don't have much fucking inventory space in any of my bags. They're all completely full. Boxes of MREs. We got a pallet of lumber, just in case I decide I need to build some shit, which inevitably I will, I guarantee it. 
Hey, what if I just a little bit, hmm, blah, blah, blah. This steak is rotten. God damn it. That's terrible. Salmon is rotten. Shit, man. I guess because I went to sleep with it in the bag. And if you wake up and you have a steak or salmon in your bag, you're probably not going to want to eat it the next day. <laughs> I mean, I probably would if I was in an apocalypse situation. But, uh, it wouldn't be a good idea. I, the only way that I'd probably not eat it is if there was some fuzzies growing on it. But honestly, after only one day, there's probably not any fuzzies growing on it. It probably just looks a little disgusting. And you can be like, oh, that's obviously slightly decayed. But that's okay. You should eat it anyways to conserve your food. And I could, honestly, but, um, yeah. One, that's fucking gross. Two, it'll probably make me queasy. Three, uh, it'll increase the boredom and unhappiness of my character, which I don't have a whole lot to combat those uh, stat drops aside from sodas, which are all the way back at my base. I think chips should decrease your unhappiness as well. Who doesn't like to eat some fucking chips? If I found a box of Doritos in the uh, Zombocalypse, I'd be like, hell yeah, man. That's what I want. That's what I need. I guess I could run. Just a little. I don't plan on fighting any of these fucking guys. So I'll see you later. I just want to get home. Can't you understand? I'm, I'm just a simple man. And there is so much stuff. That's part of, uh... Yeah. Part of Project Zomboid is just being overwhelmed by the amount of shit that is available to you to do. Honestly, uh, I would like to to stop by some of these houses and things like that and see what they all got, but yeah, my fucking bag is just so full that it's an impossibility. I'm gonna drop some cherries. Cherries up there. And hopefully this will help me remember. Oh, you've been that way. You've been that way before, Dayton. Don't you remember? Drink my Clamato juice. Mmm, Clamato. Wonderful. And at least that keeps me from being overexerted. For just a little while. Yeah, empty the bag out. We could empty the bag out and put some things in our, uh, in our other thing. Mm-hmm. That seems like a really good idea. Then I don't have to avoid all the houses completely. Unless I want to. I don't think I really want to. <laughs> hmm. Doctor's bag is completely fucking full, though. So I don't know if it's really going to do that much for me if I do stop off in a house. I just wanted to keep myself from being over exarted. Over Paul Blarted. Wouldn't that be awesome if I had a segue like Paul Blart? I should have named this character Paul Blart. Well, no, not anymore. He weighs 80 fucking pounds. This is... he. That, oh my god. That is sad. I wonder how tall he is. He better be like four foot <laughs> if he weighs 80 pounds. Then maybe he'd have some meat on him. But if he's uh, six foot two like I am and weighs 80 pounds, then you're probably dead. <laughs> you're probably dead and the coroner's already taken out all of your organs because that is amazing to me. High exertion. Should stop off somewhere, maybe. And get a little rest up. But I can't let the, the zombos spot me. Oh, there's one. <laughs> Speaking of which... Not good. I'm gonna run myself into the fucking ground. If I get, like, one that's faster than me, it's, uh... It's gonna be really ugly. It's already really ugly. Alright. We'll just walk for a little bit. 
If I can find a house or something. I think we passed most of the houses. Ugh. Frustrate. I should not have come out all this way just looking for nails. If you want me to be real honest, but... What else was I gonna do? Damn it! I need nails! And I did end up getting like 300 or so. And now it's raining. I could go up that uh, street over there where those houses were, but I'm not gonna bother. Maybe I could find some cover down this way, near the drag strip, but if I get caught by a zombie, it's gonna be fucking, fucking terrible. I've only got my uh, aluminum bat in one hand, and my exertion is extremely high, so I'm probably not gonna be able to beat him back too well, but I do need to get out of the rain. If I survive this long and catch my death from fucking rain, um, yeah, I'm gonna be really, really mad. <laughs> Here's the drag racing strip. I'll just hang out for a minute. It's raining harder. Need to move now. Okay. There we go. I'm pretty sure I picked this place clean of, like, nails and all that shit. Yeah, just some electronic scrap. Ain't no good to me. Let's have a little sit down. Make sure we uh, keep an eye on that door. There we go. How about we go over here now? Doop doop do doop do do. I know there's a. Uh, a fridge full of goodies. Mmm, goodies! Eat some broccoli's. Broccoli's and carrots. And look at all these jars of shit. I could take three jars. Or, I guess less. Because once my, uh. My shit wars off, I'm only gonna be able to carry 12 pounds. What is it called? Fed. My fed wars off. Mm-hmm. This is not fun. Did the rain stop? Nope. Damn it. No good. No es bueno. Me no reiki. I'll just keep eating from the fridge. Anything that seems uh, halfway perishable. Oh, mutton chops. Mmm. I would really like to, uh, cook that up. But I don't know if it's gonna happen. Traditional cake donut. Well, the rain is a bit less heavy now. Maybe if I make a rain poncho, I'll be okay. Um, make a poncho. There you go, poncho. Wear it. There we go. I think the rain has stopped mostly. So good. We can get back on the road after only a slight detour. And I was able to rest up, thankfully. Even though uh, I think we've still got quite a ways to get back home. This is also good for leveling the sprinting skill. It is uh, just inching up now, which is really sad. I don't like it, but I'll be so glad. Level six, level seven, level eight, level 10. What the fuck? Passive skills. What? Fitness and strength. I didn't know those were there. I'm a pretty fit motherfucker, I'll tell you that. <laughs> Alright. Up the road we go. Now the exertion is coming back. But I think that's the way to do it. Oh, damn. Now I'm a little bit wet. And there's not really anywhere to stop. Fuck, man. I hate the rain. It's like the worst 
<laughs> the worst thing ever. Ugh. Better not catch a cold. You're strong and you're fit and you're young and if you die from a cold, that'll 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 make me cry. So please don't. I think you can only get a cold if your uh, if your moodle goes up to the red. And right now it's only at the first stage, so I've got two more stages to go. Oh fuck! The rain is picking up again. Damn it. I've got a ways to go. I do think to get back home. Oh, I'm so upset. Come on. Just run. We can outrun the rain clouds. Just dip between the drops. Drip drop. Well, it seems like it's okay. I can never tell whether it's raining or not. It still is. <laughs> I usually have to go by the sound. Or you can sometimes see it falling on the ground and shit like that. But mostly, uh, yeah, it's kind of hard to see, especially when it's an extremely light rain. Which I guess I prefer to the extremely heavy rain that threatens to kill me every time I step outside. Are there seasons in this game? I don't understand. I think this is my, uh, my stop. Maybe? Anyway? Oh yeah, there's my flashlight. Okay, and now we're dry. So that's, uh, that's great. So proud of you. I don't have room for any of this shit in my bags. So I shall do without. No problem. And they're all fucking just swarming. I don't like it at all. Need to rest just a little bit before I can uh, turn around and beat the shit out of them. This is the, the Gigamart. Oh, it's relatively close to my house. Good. Open door. Hello? Somebody home? No? Okay, good. I'm in here now. Ooh, lots of baseball bats. I could craft even more spiked baseball bats if I were so inclined. Hmm. I was hoping to find some fucking nails back here. But it doesn't seem to be the case. It's all rotten food. Oh, except the honey. I'll take that. I'll take that honey. Oh. I meant to go up the stairs. <laughs> I was trying to sort through my inventory. Bad idea. That's the wrong thing to do. Well, that couch sure does look comfy. Let's just have a rest on the big comfy couch. Ah, wonderful. And I guess this is uh, how long it takes to get fully rested. So good. Now we're fully rested. I can make my way back home. I do not want that guy to break the fucking the window. Hey, 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 hey. Come over here. I'm over here, fuckhead. Yeah. I was so sure I was gonna break the window. That would not be good. Pallet of lumber. What could I do with my pallet of lumber? I guess I could build. Build a little, uh, thing across this way. That might be a good idea. Let's see. Let's see what I can do with all of the the findings that I have. Lumber stack. Three lumber stacks. Many planks. Okay, that'll do. I need some nails. Yes. 
And we'll make a, a wooden wall. Right? I think that's correct. Yeah, that's looking pretty good. As long as I don't start trying to uh, run with all this shit, it should be relatively okay. Ba -ba -ba -ba. Well, that uh, pallet of lumber didn't go as far as I had hoped that it would. Get it? Hope that it would? Ah, never mind. I don't have to impress you people. <laughs> Come on, recycle these. I need more. Can't you understand? I kind of want to build it up and uh, over. So we're not including this madness. Hmm. Curious, curious. I'll have to stick a door frame here. That'll look good. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. And then some more walls, and I'll just have to bend it over at some point. And that means we need to get the fucking sludge hammer out and uh, knock down some shit as well. But that's okay. Wooden pallet. Uh, what, what? I don't need this. <laughs> I don't give a shit about this. Where'd I get these ropes? Hmm. I don't understand. Oh, wow. There's a lot more planks here. I guess I had some forethought. Wonderfully done. Go ahead, pick them all up. We gonna finish this wall right now. And really, it's just kind of secondary security, because I get freaked out by all these fucking burnt-out buildings and shit. I don't like it at all. If I could double up the layers all around my base, I think I'd feel a lot more safe. Quite, quite. Okay. Just build. Mm-hmm. Good job. Could I build it across this thing? Or do I need to turn it already? Hmm. Yeah, I guess these planks don't go as far as I hoped either. Jeez, there was 24 of the fucking things. What do you want from me? I just underestimate my uh, ability here, I suppose. I think that I got a lot more wood than I did, which is what most of the sluts in high school think. Or something like that. <laughs> been a long time since I've been to high school. I don't even know what I'm talking about anymore. If you want me to be real honest. Oh, we need more nails. I see. Pull them shits out. Good job. Wonderful! And I bet I could build it all the way up and over. Mm-hmm. That's wonderful. Block this shit. It's like a, a natural barricade. So I could still go in there if I want. But I don't want. Mm hmm. Oh, what am I out of? Fuck. Of course. Out of the, uh, the planks. Every single time. Now, how do I get to my carpentry table? Can I recall that? Hell yeah, I can. There's some sheets, got some doorknobs, one plank. Shove some ropes in there, I don't know. Whatever, man. Put some nails. Where'd my doctor bag go? 
Why? Equip secondary. Why you do this? That lightens my load considerably. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Got an empty gas can. I think we got more empty gas cans. Just stash a bunch of shit in here. Saw, screwdriver, spike baseball bats. I put my baseball bats. That'll do. Then hopefully I'll be able to carry a couple of gas cans back. I think the math works out on that. That's gonna go just fine. Can never have too many gas cans. That's a fact. Go ahead and slide this out of the bag. Slide the other one out of the bag. That's right, there was a full-ass gas can, but... I guess that'll be useful for when we uh, really run out of everything. Ah. Take some fuel. Thank God the pumps are still working. That's all I can say. Alright. Two full-ass gas cans. Load them up. Load them up and ship them out. And uh, I guess I could chop down some more trees and shit like that, but I'm not really so concerned about completing that part of the base wall. It was just kind of like, hey, we have some, some lumber. Let's do something with it. Instead of saving it like a smart person. Whatever. Hello? Hello? How did these zombies get here? Were they always here? I can't recall. Doesn't matter. Cause they're dead. Cause we killed them. Cause they're dead. Jar with lid. Yeah, I'll put all this shit here. It looks like it'll fit. Adhesive tapes, broccoli seeds, butter. Hmm. Don't really know what to do with that at the moment. Put more seeds over here. Mm-hmm. Maybe a little wood glue. Oh, and I am hungry. I'll eat this donut. And the radishes are not uh, looking very appetizing at the moment. Can I fit them somewhere? No, of course not. Why would you be able to do that? There. You can go there. Fishing net trap. Should probably go set this up. Just real quick. Actually, you know what? I'll set it up the next time that I uh, get up to go fishing or something like that. I should throw these gas cans somewhere. And then... I can get a... A little bit of action going with the, the rifles and shit that I have. I want to get a rifle all decked out. So I can go fucking level my firearm skill just a little more. And I know there's a lot of... Uh, a lot of interesting shit in here. Let's see. Ammo, 7.62. We got a few of those. AR-10. Just equip. Mm-hmm. Wonderful. Use for 308 Winchester? No. I don't think that's right. Let's just pull some, uh... Oh, fuck. The ammo's in the doctor's bag. Okay. Herb, skirt, rewind. There. Got three full, full rounds for this. Reload the sucker. Equip in both hands. Alright. Rifle sling. Can I use this for AR-10? Maybe? Rifle tactical light. It seems like I should be able to use some of this for the AR. No? 
Hmm. I don't think so. That's a shame. It doesn't make no sense. It's just a rifle sling. It, it doesn't require any fucking anything. Anything at all! AR-10. Skeletal stock. I know I can equip this. Hmm. It lists the AR-10. Full auto AR-10. Semi-auto AR-10. Huh. It doesn't make sense to me. Well, I'm still quite unsure how these uh, weapon add-ons work. Oh, there's the M249. That's the hot one in Rust. People like that shit. And who could blame them, honestly? Pistol, tactical light, rifle, tactical light. Hmm. Interesting. Interesting, and I wish I knew how it worked, but I just, I just really don't. And it's time for bed, so we'll have to give this rifle some use tomorrow. And I'm relatively full on everything. Basically everything. But we'll go put that fishing trap down. Cause some more trouble. You know how we do. Anyways, friends, I've been Brandon Dayton, your humble narrator. I sincerely hope that you will join us for the next time. Please don't forget to like, comment, and or subscribe if you did enjoy the episode. And if you do, friends, I'll send you an AR-10 of your very own. And it does have a tactical light attached because, uh, it's easy to do it in real life. You can just attach it and it's not that complicated. Anyways, <laughs> I'll see you in the next one, friends. Thanks so much for watching. And until then, bye bye One, two, three, four. Goodbye, goodbye, see you again. Goodbye, goodbye, see you, my friends.